ankle sprain journal login. It's been, let's say four weeks and three days. And I feel like I am keeping track of my newborn baby. But when you're injured and you love a sport so much, you really count the days to when you can start playing at full capacity again. And last Thursday, you saw me jumping, but I was being really careful and I was jumping like 10 inches off the floor. I, it didn't really feel like a huge victory. It just felt like another step in progress. But today felt like a big jump. It was the first time where I was able to do like a parallel squat. Now that's not to my full depth as before because before I can go like front squat, upright torso, ass to grass. Um, but this has been a big step. All my ankle mobility and the ankle banded distraction that I've shown you in a previous day and that's been helping get like a millimeter more or maybe one or two degrees more of ankle or talus rotation, which is the, the ankle bone in front of the foot or in front of the ankle, sorry. Super tired from the workout, so my mind's not working well. And I was like, today might be the day where I can actually do a full two foot approach jump onto a decently high box and I did it. It still felt the, the tendons on the inside of my ankle kind of stretch a little bit uncomfortably. So it still was uncomfortable, but I wouldn't be able to do this during last week's workout when I tried to do the two foot approach jump, it actually hurt. But today I feel confident that coming Tuesday when I have my volleyball training, I think I can actually do a, a spike, like an actual spiking motion with an 80% jump and hard swing. And then that means on Thursday, when we actually do have our open gym, I'm able to play 100% or at least close to it. Still gonna tame my ankle just to be safe for now, but feeling pretty good and doing my opposite footwork where I'm breaking my momentum with my right foot on the block step also felt pretty good. I didn't feel any pain with that, just on my right left jump. Today will be an interesting day because first time I'm actually going to try to max jump or at least get close to max jumping for spiking during our volleyball training sessions. And I'm not wearing any ankle brace. I wanna see how it feels to land and then work up from there. Are you looking to buy some new volleyball gear? Then I highly recommend shopping at my favorite volleyball store, All Volleyball. You can buy everything volleyball related from balls, shorts, training equipment, coaching equipment, and much more. They also have the widest and latest selection of volleyball shoes, customizable team jerseys, and amazing customer service. Use my discount code and link below to get 5% off your entire order and all orders over $75 receive free shipping. So get yourself some new volleyball gear today.
that spiking session turned out better than I thought. I think resting it a whole week, actually one to two weeks before, and keeping it taped up while I was playing at open gym, but then keeping consistent with my recovery when it came to daily mobilization, daily massages, and also keeping up my strength with whatever strength exercises that I could do that wouldn't aggravate my ankle. The only difference today was that I was favoring my left leg a lot, especially when I was landing, which I think is pretty normal because my right brain subconsciously still does not trust that my right ankle can handle it. Also, it just felt weird putting that much more effort into my jump since I've been moving pretty gingerly. So having to retrain my body how to jump with the same timing and intensity almost feels like my right leg has been wobbly. So I was really trying to be careful with my landings and not try to be super explosive and change direction. Actually, it was even hard to kind of change direction of my path. You'll see me kind of slowly try to adjust to certain things, but just not able to get my feet there. And I was okay with that because this has only been like week number four in part of my recovery process. So another step along my recovery process and hopefully I'll be able to jump a little bit higher next week.